The Caribbean Court of Justice has ruled that Guyana's cross-dressing law is unconstitutional and should be struck down. On Tuesday, at the CCJ on Henry Street in Port of Spain, a panel which included CCJ President Justice Saunders ruled that Section 153-148 of the Summary Jurisdiction Offences Act was contrary to the rule of law. Karen Cousier Phillip reports. The Caribbean Court of Justice, CCJ, has ruled that a law in Guyana which makes it a criminal offence for a man or a woman to appear in a public place while dressed in clothing of the opposite sex for an improper purpose is unconstitutional. The law, Section 153, Subsection 148 of the Summary Jurisdiction Offences Act is to be struck from the laws of Guyana. In February 2009, several trans women were arrested and convicted in Georgetown under the 1893 Summary Jurisdiction Offences Act of the offence of being a man appearing in female attire in public for an improper purpose. One year later, Quincy McEwen, Sion Clark, Joseph Fraser, Sion Passard, and the Society Against Sexual Orientation Discrimination, SASOD, brought an action challenging the constitutionality of the law enacted in Guyana in 1893 as part of the vagrancy laws of the post-emancipation era. The matter was appealed to the Guyana Court of Appeal and finally to the CCJ. The five-member CCJ panel, headed by its president, Justice Adrian Saunders, agreed that this law was from a different time and no longer served any legitimate purpose in Guyana, with Justice Saunders reiterating that law and society are dynamic, not static. A majority of the judges also upheld the appeal on the basis that the law resulted in transgendered and gender non-conforming persons being treated unfavorably by criminalizing their gender expression and gender identity. The court ordered that Section 153, Subsection 148 be struck from the laws of Guyana and that costs are to be awarded to the appellants in the appeal before the CCJ. Karen Cozier-Philip, TDT News.